guys uh, got some news. Uh, Dynamite is bringing back another character. Recently, uh, it was announced, actually, I think a week ago, that um, the Dynamite was going to bring back the Shadow. Now they're bringing back another classic character. And I'm really excited for this one, because uh, this one's awesome to me. Uh, Flash Gordon. Yes, I know. Yes, for those who don't know, probably none of you know, Flash Gordon is one of my favorite uh, um, classic characters. I, I think Flash Gordon is awesome. Um, so yeah, when I saw the news, uh, when I saw on Comic Vine uh, that Flash Gordon's getting a uh, getting a comic book written uh, that's being written by, I mean the artwork. Wait, let me back up. Let me back uh, back up a bit because I'm looking at the article as I as I'm telling you this. Uh, who's doing this is basically the people who are doing this is Alex Ross. He's helped writing the uh, writing the script and doing the cover artwork, and um, he, it's being written by Eric Trotman, and the interior art's being ri ri um, done by Daniel Lindro. I think that you pronounce that. That's how you pronounce that name. Um, yeah, but Alex Ross is writing the script to this. So, yeah, he, him, and Eric Trotman. I hope I'm saying that last name. Alex Ross and Eric Trotman are writing the script to the to Flash Gordon, while uh, Tony Lindro. Yeah, Lindro. Okay. Uh, Tony Lindro is doing the interior art. Or, okay, now everything, now it got everything settled. But yeah, Flash Gordon, man, Dynamite, you're doing pretty good. I mean, first you you bring back the Green Hornet, then the Bionic Man, then the Shadow. Now you're doing Flash Gordon. Damn, Dynamite. But yeah, apparently this it's going to be a mini series called Zelgeist. Uh. Zielgeist or something, and it's going to be Flash Gordon fighting Emperor Ming and Adolf Hitler. Oh, okay, I'm in. <laughs> okay, um, the the King of the Impossible. Yeah, there's a t it, for the you probably know what uh, the movie I'm referencing, the Flash Gordon movie with the the Queen song. I su suggest everyone who loves Flash Gordon check out the um, Flash Gordon movie theme done by Queen. It's it's cheesy, but it's awesome at the same time. But yeah, I don't know what it's um, what it's about. I'll leave the art. I don't want to give too much away. I'll leave the article below. They give they don't give out a lot because the cover says everything. A, a Flash Gordon's going to fight Emperor Ming and Adolf Hitler. So yeah, okay, I'm in. Flash Gordon, awesome. I haven't seen him. In, I haven't seen a Flash Gordon comic in a long time. So it'll be cool to see uh, Flash come back and uh, you know take on two major villains, you know, a, a real life villain and a made up villain at once. And I'm, I'm wondering what Alex Ross has got cooked up in his head for Flash Gordon and if this is just going to be a mini series or are they going to make it an ongoing series like the other comics. But all in all, really hyped up for this. Um, this comes out in November and I can't wait. But you guys tell me, um, for those who are Flash Gordon fans, uh, you guys tell me what you think of all this and uh, uh, yeah, I'm really, I'm really excited. Um, but yeah, Di Dynamite's really kicking it. I mean, they're bringing out a lot of pulp characters and a lot of classic characters and, you know, licensing them. So this is going to be fun. All right, guys, uh, I'm out. <laughs>